Hi, I'm Silvio and this is part 16 of my Christmas Village 2020 full tutorial series. Internal conflict. That is what I am struggling with at the moment. Part of me is happy because today is finally the day of the gathering. And another part of me is terribly sad because this means that this series is nearing its conclusion, its end. I am at the point where all the basics of the village are done and it is useless to add more details without first checking if all the buildings, all the table accents, street furniture, trees, low walls will find a place on the layout and will accommodate correctly and harmoniously without damaging the depth of view and leaving enough space for all the figurines. A lot of figurines. Before getting serious with the gathering and try to explain to you what does it means for me, let me do two things. First one, this series is mostly for you guys and if or when someone asks for something and if this something is in my possibilities, if I am able to do it, obviously I will try my best to do it. So this first thing is for you, Isabel Sofia Silva. You just asked, uh, why don't you make a small video detailing how the village is going, uh, how is the trend, the actual trend of the village? Sure, I will do it right now and I'm sorry if I haven't done it before. You just ask for a quick update and this will be a quick update far from being the perfect way of filming a Christmas village but this will be an argument for a future part of this series. Let's do it. Let's start from the first level. Let's go from uh, left to right. So, starting from the left, the gallery, the train tunnel, still missing uh, some parts here, also all the um, stairs here is missing uh, some details, especially in uh, the corner there, I will need to add uh, some vegetation, but the stairs are done and uh, um, I just needed to paint uh, something here and, and there. Also, all along the uh, railroad, I need to paint or add some paper, uh, some rock paper here, and so and fill the gap you are. If I have here, I have a gap here, and I need to do something to uh, hide it. Proceeding with the first uh, level, I still miss some uh, fences all along the railroad, but without having all the buildings in place, it will be useless. The lake, uh, the lake is missing something all along the border, some vegetation, something. I still need to uh, take uh, the power uh, cable from the pump and hide it uh, somewhere and, uh, and the river bed, the river and uh, uh, the two banks uh, are almost uh, completed, are almost done just need to add uh, some uh, snow here and there and uh, paint uh, some of the base of uh, the uh, plants and vegetation here for example I have an almost orange uh, base for this uh, plant, so I will need to paint it. And uh, the, stair is, the stairs here are missing the, uh, the fences, but I will add them uh, right after this first uh, part. Also, the, the, um, the train, the track support here is missing some rock paper and some uh, painting. Proceeding with the first uh, level here, I still miss some vegetation or some uh, or something else to uh, add to these walls. 
the stairs are completed uh, still needed to do everything in this part of the first level because I need to place uh, buildings before and the position of the um, the bridge isn't decided yet and uh, this is the first uh, level quickly uh, done I think yes let's proceed with the second level the second level there all this part uh, is missing all the buildings I can't add anything more before placing uh, the buildings and also uh, the railroad there uh, is uh, missing uh, some details but as I've explained to you I will need to remove some of the uh, rock paper to hide the power cables for the buildings this part completely to do I don't know yet what I will add here and the stairs too are to be completed also all the pins I've used let me do uh, <coughs> a zoom there also all those pins there I have a pins here I have a pins there they still need to be painted because I don't want anything metallic to uh, be visible uh, when the village will be done so I will paint them, them with some black and some uh, brown still uh, need to finish all that uh, let's proceed so here we go second level uh, this uh, so let's go with the second level all uh, this uh, part here uh, is missing buildings and everything else so I can't proceed uh, any more further the pins uh, here need to be painted and something to the stairs need to be added uh, from the uh, railroad side also this part is completed uh, I still need something there but those are final details it's uh, useless to do them right now some trees need to be added here and there uh, the other part of the second uh, level here the second level in the same situation as I've told you uh, before and this is uh, completed the third uh, level let's talk about the third level all the buildings need to be added right there and the bridge the bridge is uh, the only thing that I'm sure uh, will remain in that uh, position uh, because it's the only uh, position that uh, avoid damaging the depth of uh, view uh, the third level is extended then from this side too uh, I need to place all the buildings let's have a detailed and uh, final view I haven't done anything to this section because uh, I still uh, need uh, to decide uh, all the placements for the buildings. Uh, this uh, part uh, will be used, I think I will use it if uh, I need to add uh, some more um, platforms, some more uh, levels from, uh, for the buildings because as I told you before I am not uh, completely convinced that I will have enough space for all the buildings uh, the uh, little hill, the little mountain and uh, the waterfall uh, as concerning uh, the other side, the side where the, uh, the water will flow is uh, uh, practically completed, some more details to be added here and there also this uh, part of the uh, the river is completed with all the vegetation as you have seen me uh, do, do in the last uh, videos uh, some more snow here and there because it is a winter village so I will need to add some um, little uh, snow here and there and uh, this is the uh, this part as concerning uh, the, uh, the big bridge I've made, it's almost done. I am, I am 
uh, uncertain if I will add some street lamps on top of it or not. It all depends uh, when I start placing all the street uh, lamps. Uh, the canyon, uh, the canyon, uh, the canyon down there is uh, uh, done. Uh, it's still missing a lot of snow uh, and uh, everything else. Also, I've added the, the, the fences all along this uh, bridge and the bridge is uh, completed right now. Let's proceed with uh, another uh, section. This uh, section here. Uh, the stairs uh, are completed now, uh, but as you can uh, see, uh, the glue has become almost uh, transparent, so uh, I will need to paint uh, some, uh, some details because they aren't enough uh, white. Um, the glue is almost white uh, transparent and I need to paint it with some little uh, white. Uh, this uh, part, this uh, section here, I still need to place the buildings, obviously, and try to find uh, space for all the cables. I don't know. I will never know until I start uh, placing uh, the buildings, until I start the gathering, how it will proceed, how it will uh, uh, go from uh, now on from this side is done. Also the canyon here is uh, done, here and there. Uh, the railroad is completed, I still need to paint some brown here and there, add some vegetation all along the walls of uh, the, uh, all along the, this wall and also to paint the, the pins I've used to secure the rock paper to the uh, to the wall. I will not do anything right now here because this will be either the sun uh, with some more rock paper. The final uh, level, this is the final level, the fourth level, completely undone because uh, right now uh, I need to go uh, off and uh, make some uh, modification, add something uh, on the back so this isn't uh, at the moment uh, fixed in any uh, way. It will be the last thing I will do and uh, if I need I will need to add uh, an extra level on top of this to modify a little bit my depth of view in case I lack space for the buildings. From now on all will be uh, dictated by buildings, by the harmony I want for the overall aspect of the village. And the waterfall from this side, here we go with the waterfall, uh, almost completed. All the, all the walls here and there need some vegetation because I don't like them like that. Some trees here or there, or some little uh, bushes, I don't know uh, yet. This will be done in the final stage of the series. And that's all I think. I've done a quick tour of the village. Still a lot of things to do. I'm quite behind the schedule, because honestly, last year my village uh, at this date was practically completed and I was uh, thinking the, uh, how to make a, a video, how to organize my video. But this year I'm going uh, slowly because uh, I need uh, time for uh, video editing. So. Mm, it's normal that I'm behind the schedule. I hope that will satisfy what you asked, uh, Isabel. And uh, again, I'm sorry if uh, uh, I haven't done it before and if this is roughly done and quickly done. And uh, please, whoever needs uh, something to be detailed more deeply uh, or if uh, you need to know something I've missed to detail or to tell, 
please don't hesitate, just ask for it. I won't promise I will able to do it correctly, but at least I will try uh, to satisfy your needs, your uh, demands. And finally, Isabel, thank you for asking for this. This is the correct spirit I want for this channel. Thanks. And uh, second thing, uh, let me just uh, finish the stairs down there. I have prepared the fences, I just need to uh, place uh, them correctly. And I will finish uh, this by adding uh, a background to the village, because I need it in order to decide if uh, the depth of view I will uh, have once the buildings are placed is uh, correct or not.
I am sorry, but the camera battery died just uh, some minutes before I was done with the last mountain for the background, so I lost many minutes of footage. I'm sorry. Um, so the background is uh, completed for now. Let's do the gathering. I wanna tell you that I love you 100 times a day You'll get tired of my voice That's how much I'm gonna tell you that I'll miss you I'll miss you if you go Yes, I'm gonna let you know Just how much I tell you mama You're the only 
will have serious problems from now on. As you have already figured out, all the holes that could be filled are filled. I have no more room for anything else. Not a single figurines, nothing of nothing of nothing. And actually it is just a pure mess. And I will have to think seriously about it. And by the way, I still lack two buildings because I haven't done yet the review, so they are still in the box. So I need to figure out where to put those, ox those extra two buildings. As I said, I am in big troubles. I will have to sit down right here for many hours and try to figure out where to put everything. I don't know. I really don't know what to do. I will s s certainly have to add some more levels here. This open space here, I could uh, add another pillar here and then add some more level here, maybe two levels, two levels, because I don't think I will find a place to accommodate everything. And just remember, all the low walls, all the uh, trees, and all the figurines, I have a lot of figurines, and I have to put them all into the village, because the figurines are the soul of the village. And by the way, I've grouped down there, everything is generating a sort of movement. They will have the role to attract the attention of the viewer, so I will put each one of them separately in certain key point of the layout. They will be the focus of the scenes. Around them, each scene will be developed. And uh, some of these table accents, I know the shop sign is in French, but who cares right now? Uh, as I was saying, uh, some of these table accents have already some power cable attached to them. And I will explain uh, how I will use them uh, lately. I'm a little depressed right now. I think f that for the first time I will have troubles finishing the layout. I need some time to think about everything. And I just want to show you a last thing. I can't avoid to add these little houses there. They are absolutely out of scale. I will generally put them in the far background, but they are the ancestor of all my uh, villages. I started with them, with just them, many, many years ago, when I still didn't know anything about a Christmas village as I intended them today. <clears throat> and uh, maybe 10 years ago when uh, Lemax here in Europe wasn't as diffuse as it is today. But I can't betray them. I need to put them every year in each of my villages. It's a tradition for me. And I've also repaired them many, many times. Each uh, of these uh, uh, buildings, little buildings, uh, got problems, got some lighting problems. Uh, this one got a motor problem. Here, the Santa is turning 360 degrees. 
and so I've replaced the live thing internally. Uh, some of them have optic fibers and uh, I also had to repair them many times. And as you have seen before, some of those buildings have something repairs to do. Uh, let, ah, yes, I've shown you before. Here, I have to glue back uh, this little tree and uh, all the, these buildings need maintenance from time to time. This because when they made these buildings they used super glue, but super glue isn't eternal. And for that reason, from time to time, each building needs some maintenance. And the maintenance means putting back together all the single pieces that, that came apart. I need to re-glue them back where they belong. First thing I will do that, but not right now. I think it's time for ending this uh, video. Here also the little snowman need to be glued back there. So the same thing for this little tree. Same thing for these pieces and this one and the little dog down there. I'm sorry, I won't be able to show you any of the starting process involved in deciding where to put everything. I don't know. Okay, bye. This array, pure, simple and petrifying this array. That's all I'm feeling right now. <laughs> if only I could go back some hours and just feel the good discomfort of my internal conflict. The project is too advanced to try to modify it radically. The obvious and quick solution is to renounce to some buildings, but unfortunately I'm not used to cheating. Every problem has a solution, sometimes it is easily found, sometimes you just have to work a little harder to find it. A uh, woof, what have I said? I just got a flashback of me at seven, sitting in front of my grandfather while I was trying to learn the nine times table and they told me the same exact words. My mental disorder is getting worse. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment and give thumbs up. Thank you for watching, thank you for bearing my absolutely awful English and, if you wish, see you next time.